All right, could electric scooters be back in Milwaukee by the summer? You might remember the bird scooters landed here in Milwaukee last year. They were eventually ruled illegal and removed. Katie Crowther has the latest, though, on the possibility the birds could return making electric scooters legal on Wisconsin roads. I think it's a great idea. A proposal from state rep Cindy Duco would do that, but give cities the power to set limitations. We've already heard it in the assembly and we're hoping to take it to the floor um, in the next, I say beginning of June and talking to the scooter people. There's actually three scooters. There is Lime, Bird and Uber. They think they can be ready to go in a matter of weeks. Milwaukee has already worked on all of its ordinances, so they're up and running and they're hoping to have them on the road by Summerfest. The city of Milwaukee sued the maker of bird scooters last summer after those scooters showed up unannounced. I have a problem with a company that basically ignores the city's role as a referee of the public right of way and just comes in here and does things without any discussion. Megan Cochran spoke out when she was six months pregnant, saying a man on a bird scooter ran into her near Brady and Farwell. I wasn't bruised, so my baby's fine, um, but it was enough to shake me up. Within two months of first arriving, all bird scooters were removed from Milwaukee, but not before more than 5,000 people used them, recording about 25,000 miles. Even after they were gone, Mayor Tom Barrett foreshadowed a possible return. I think people ultimately will be able to ride them, but let's let's do this the right way. If passed by the state legislature, Bird and other electric scooter companies would be able to operate throughout the state, but they would have to follow the guidelines and ordinances of individual cities. In Milwaukee, Katie Crowther, today's TMJ4.